If you're used to getting push notifications on your iPhone for various apps, when you get a message or something pops up, it usually should pop up directly on your phone. But if that's not working, there are a number of different things you can do to get it to work. The first thing we're gonna do is go into your settings app. So open up the settings app here on your iPhone. And the first thing that we will do is scroll down until we get to notifications here, right above sounds and haptics, just tap on that. Now, of course, the first thing we need to check to see is if notifications are actually turned on. Now on here, you can see at the very top, you wanna choose either count, stack, or I like the list option. Next, you're going to scroll down here and you're going to find that specific app that you think you should be getting that notifications for. So for instance, if I go down and let's say Instagram on this list, it's turned off. I want to make sure this is turned on. And on here under alerts, I want to choose whatever I feel comfortable with. Let's say banners and notification center. Now on here, you can see everything is turned on for this app. However, that doesn't necessarily mean that the Instagram app itself has those notifications turned on. So you might need to go into the Instagram app itself, tap on the profile button at the bottom right, and then tap on the three lines at the top right. Now from here, you can just tap on notifications right under your activity. And of course, you need to make sure they're all turned on. So for instance, under messages, you can see if I have any of these turned off, even if I have notifications turned on for my phone, it still won't send me those notifications. So you want everything to be turned on. So basically go into that app, find the notification settings in that app, and make sure those are turned on as well. Now, if that's still not working, the next thing that we're going to do is swipe down from the top right, and you're going to check to see if you have a silent mode turned on or a focus mode turned on. So if you have silent mode turned on, then just turn that off. And then also tap on the focus mode here, and you can see if you have do not disturb or any other focus mode turned on, you're just going to tap on it to turn that off. This will allow those notifications to come through on your iPhone and essentially not silence those. Now, if you go through all these steps and it's still not working, let's get into your settings again. And we'll go back to the very beginning of your settings. From the beginning of your settings, you can see towards the bottom is the general option. Tap on the general option. And we're gonna do two things that I recommend everybody doing when they're in trouble or find any kind of bugs or issues on their phone. One is tap on software update and see if there's a software update both for the iOS operating system as well as that app. So you can open up the app store as well and try to update that app. The next thing we'll do is go back out of here and tap on the shutdown button at the very bottom. You'd be surprised how many times just updating your phone or restarting your phone fixes a lot of issues on your phone itself. Now, if you go through all of those steps, but the notifications are still not coming through to your phone, the last thing I would recommend doing is tapping on the transfer or reset iPhone. Again, this is in the general settings of your iPhone. Then we'll tap on reset here and at the very top, tap on reset all settings. Basically enter in your passcode and maybe your screen time passcode if you have one and go through the process of resetting all of those settings just back to the factory default. This will definitely fix your issues and get all those push notifications delivered to your phone.